Hi guys, welcome back and welcome back on board this Phelan 300E. Uh, we're just doing a short positioning flight today, taking the aircraft from London Oxford to London Stansted Airports. We just need a new set of rear tyres on the aircraft and uh, also get some minor maintenance faults fixed. So we're here in Oxford in the United Kingdom. The wind's from the north, so we're going to pass on runway 01, taking off and then doing a right turn towards our first point of uh, Westcott's, Whiskey Charlie Oscar, climbing to flight level 70, then we're going to head off to the east, joining halfway down the star, going into London Stansted. And London Stansted with the northerly winds, they'll be using runway 04. So we'll probably just take the RLS in just to fit in amongst the uh, other traffic. Flight time should be around 20 minutes or so and uh, pretty smooth flying conditions. Not many clouds in the sky, so uh, come along and enjoy. Thanks. Oxford Ground, good afternoon. Saxon Air 000. Saxon Air 000, Oxford Ground, good afternoon. Saxon Air 000, Phantom 300, down uh, MA4, information Romeo, requesting start IFR to uh, Stansted. Saxon Air 000, no delay to Stansted, start approved. Start approved, thanks, Saxon Air 000. Right, okay, so we're going to start engine number two, the voltage is above 24, we have got a tailwind and it's a battery start, so we just need to keep a good eye on the uh, ITT. So, aircraft is clear on the right, there's no marshaller, and clear on the left. So, on to run initially, and clock's running, start. So, M2 is picking up, ignition A, and lights off with fuel flow. Battery voltage remains good. Tops out, 495, enter 55, self-sustaining, 28.3 volts, everything looks good on number two side. Right, we can get some checks done out of the way so we can do the stall test. Stall, stall. I'll do a full and free at the same time. Stall, stall. Stall, stall. And that's correct. Stall, stall. Test panel goes off on the FMSs, get rid of the speakers. So it doesn't annoy anyone else at the back. And this is a good time. We've got two minutes ground, from starting the engine from a battery, four just allow the batteries to cool. So if we run the clock there, we've got two minutes to uh, tie up any more items inside. And we went from the number one time. Do we know you, Gordon? Ah, oh, there you go. The two minutes has uh, gone up, so we can start engine number one soon. Still clear on the left, still clear on the right. To run initially, so number two is going to spool up, starting now. So number two spools up to 72% on the N2. Just to assist the start. Short the main taxiway. Right, turn and hold at the main taxiway. So number one, rotation, ignition alpha. And lights off. Voltages look good. That's a good start. N2 stable, we're up 52%. And on number two, that's spawning down. Right, I can restart the stopwatch there. And continue with the after start check. So, GPU, no, we didn't use that. Electrical emergency, so I'm going to push that button. Looking for three whites, also for 23.5. That's all looks good. That comes back out. Patch voltage is a check. Stall test we have done. Test panel has all been complete. OCS control units have got roll heading and takeoff, and uh, we've got nothing else in there since we haven't got an IFR clearance. Engine takeoff data has been set. LFE is green for stance depth, 350 feet. Takeoff speeds all set. If you want to rotate both at 105, V2, 117, and the VFS at 129. Transponders on 2000 fly far. We get to get a code. Altimeter is 1026, is last known. 243 checks three times. 
Flight controls have been checked, trim set for departure, 9.8. Zero, 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 just planning how long until you're ready for taxi. Uh, we're going to taxi in uh, about three or four minutes. Taxi, zero, zero, zero. Got to set for uh, number one, take off as per plan, external lights, we've got now some emergency lights armed at the moment, and mass protection is not quite for this departure. So taking off from here, we're going to do A, onto MA4, then onto taxiway Alpha to hold on runway 01. To parking, taxiway Bravo, Alpha and Juliet, further at your discretion. Bravo 4. Saxon, there's a request taxi. Saxon, there's a request taxi. Saxon Air 00, Zulu, report to Mike. Port of Mike, Saxon Air 00. Parking brake is off, taxi lights are on. Clear on the right, clear on the left. Let's get going. So, echo for rolling forward, just checking the brakes. Very good. So, right turn coming in. Wing 6 clear. So, Port of Mike, that's a holding point just on the left after this open. Uh, Saxon Air 00 Zulu, Zulu Mike. Saxon Air 00 Zulu, Zulu Taxi, on the point Alpha 1, the runway 015, Taxiway Alpha. Alpha 1, zero 1 by Alpha, uh, Saxon Air 00 Zulu. Alright, take off checks. Take off, OK. Traffic button has been checked, cast messages, we are all clear. Signs outlets are checked, your damper is off. Transponder yet to come. Passengers and lights. Next checks after take off. Saxon Air 00, Zulu, departure instructions when you're ready to come. Uh, we'll copy the holding point, Saxon Air 00. Just as I'm flying a single pilot, I'm just going to take it out the holding point rather than uh, trying to rise everything down when I'm taxiing. Alright, so just zooming out on the middle map, getting a bit of orientation, a bit of traffic floating about, so we'll just keep a really good eye on that. Approaching runway 01. Alright, so just approaching the holding point there. Airbus 3, Airbus 3, Grand Ham, parking goes on. Airbus 3, 3, 2, Kilo 2. Saxon Air 00, Zulu, Alpha 1, ready to copy, uh, clear. Saxon Air 00, Zulu, Zulu, ready to hold Alpha 1, after departure, it's a right turn, direct to Westcott, uh, Clinton Transit, Delta 129, climb to altitude 5,000 feet, squawk 7770. Thank you, close sir. That's departure, right turn on track, Westcott, Clinton Transit, Delta 129, climbing 5,000 feet, on the squawk 7770, Saxon Air 00, Zulu. Saxon Air 00, zero Zulu, correct report, ready. And uh, we're okay, it's actually 7700 and the about squawk there, 5000 feet. I'll keep it in heading initially and then I'll control the turbo south. And try to sink Delta 1. Ground passage message. Ground bounce three, permission to move from Kilo down to Juliet. Bowser 3, proceed Kilo. Right, I'm all happy. Kilo to Juliet, Bowser 3. Uh, Saxon Air, Zulu, 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 Right, just one on final there. See him on uh, TCAS. So I think we'll be after him. I right, can't see anything behind him there. Nothing on the TCAS in terms of effects. I suspect we're next. Uh, he's going around. Edge 2 1 going around. Edge 2 1 just. Back there, zero, 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 fire off one line up and wait, you're on my zero, 01. Alpha 1, Alpha 8, so what? Saxon Air 00, Zulu. Well, lights are on. Golf Alpha Tango, contact ground 121, one, one, 
So, wind from the right, problem number two will turn this wind, problem number one, continue straight. Please hold it, then report final, number one, Golf Tango DA40 in the climb out, turning left now, runway sure. 01, wind 040, 11 one knots, clip for takeoff. Visual traffic, clip for takeoff, runway 01, slash 0 Okay, all happening. So stable. And faster. ATR green. Must take off, disagree, disregard. 80 knots, checks. B1, rotate. Positive rate, gear up, flight level change. So light aircraft, coldish day. We're looking for about 20 degrees nose up, so just controlling the speed there. Heading green, 600 feet, all the it goes on. And a thousand, lap set zero. Alright, clear to accelerate, climb for a step. We'll do a right turn towards the scope. Radar 125, that's all 090, 090, we're by. What about 090, 090, Alright, Westcott, nav we have. Picking up in 2000 feet. Sergeant 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 Traffic service, Saxon SSSU. And you're clear to transmit Delta 129. Clear to transmit, Saxon SSSU. Thousand feet to go. Leaving my area now, so it's all confused. Heading sync. Just pulling the press back, up to 20 knots. Zooming out to the map, looking for traffic. Alright, nothing seems to affect. That's the takeoff checklist. Landing gear is up, flaps are set to zero, thrust sleeves assessing the crew setting, altimeters. Just about to level at 5,000 feet, 1026. Your damper is confirmed on. Rest of above the line, we'll just put the uh, landing lights off. Next checklist will be descent. So the next thing we're going to expect will be a clearance into London's airspace. Let's bring speed up to 250. Fax message is in. Right. See on the screen. Fax message is in. Fax message is in. Alright, uh, 250 knots. Um, That's Zulu. Just to call to London now for hiring to the uh, controlled airspace on 121, decimal 2820. Hello. Okay, what's the one? 208, today. Hello. Okay, what's the one? 208, Zulu. Alright, that's set. London, good afternoon. Saxon Zulu, 5,000 feet west go. Saxon Zulu, thank you, Scott, today. I don't hear Zulu, Saxon Zulu. So as soon as we get clearance into airspace. Basic service outside, Saxon Air Zulu. And Saxon Air Zulu, clear to control airspace on track Westcott after Westcott, then direct Barclay in the climb, flight level 7 0. Clear to control airspace, Westcott Barclay, climbing flight level 7 0, Saxon Air Zulu. Alright, let's get up because there's traffic within our vicinity. 7 0 set, vertical speed, 1800 feet. Climbing. London, hello, EC42, Golf X3, uh, climbing altitude 5000 feet, Compton 7 Charlie. EC42, Golf X3. Thank See if we can get an ACES. Expect an ILS approach. Runway is 04, runway 04. Runway condition codes 6, 6, 6. Dry, dry, dry. Depth, not reported, not reported, not reported. Coverage, not reported, not reported, not reported. Transition level, flight level, 
Holding point, uniform is closed. Taxiway got this close between Foxtrot and uniform. Taxiway got this close between Foxtrot and uniform. Runway may not be approved. Runway centre line lighting is unavailable. There is limited green centre line lighting at multiple holding points. Bit of a ridiculous HSS. Category 3 holding points and units. Three point zero three zero one three knots. Visibility one zero kilometre or more. Two thousand seven hundred feet. Temperature plus two point five plus one unit one zero two five. Ground is open. Captain there, zero zero zero, leave the center control that is radar control service. Continue present heading as a radar heading. Radar control service, continue heading, heading zero seven seven, seven tax there, zero zero zero. That was the world's most ridiculous ATIS with just about every no tab on it. But uh, highlights, 041225 for the local pressure. 1025, that's the pre select. Let's get our landing data plugged in. So landing on runway 04, runway conditions are dry. That all checks. Bar resource at the destination. Flight now, flight level 80. Flight now, flight level 80, Saxon ATIS. You know when I said it's going to be a busy flight, this is it. <laughs> now the approach, 10 knots above. So, 8 zero set, uh, 1200 feet on vertical speed, holding 250 knots quite nicely. Landing data, VRAF 111, that's what expected. Right, that's all in. Looking at the flight plan, we've got the RLS, all plugged into the FMS there, via Laurel. Let's get the plate up. Hello, easy 578 Charlie, is climbing 6,000. Alice 04, so that's Altes, captured. Fly radar heading 345. Fly radar heading 345. 578 Charlie. Easy 14, Altes, green. Now, flight level 160. Flight now, flight level 160. Easy 14, Altes. So, 04, 2. Final approach track and frequencies 110.5, set once, twice, and on the DME as well. Miss approach straight ahead, stop above 3,000 feet, so we'll have that selected, and then a uh, left turn to uh, Parkway. Easy 578 Charlie, climb now, flight level 120. 3 degree glide, platform altitude 2,500 feet, they'll keep the speed high on this, it'll probably be 165 till 4, so uh, we we'll expect to be configured. But no, zero, 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 just for your planning, it will be radar, but for left place, it's Okay, copy, it's Get a flight plan in just for the moment, uh, but that makes life easier for us. So uh, we'll plan to be about uh, stage one of flap on interception, and then uh, we'll probably take the gear at five miles, and then uh, start fully configuring back to uh, the approach at four miles. The uh, decision altitude 532. No temperature compensation needed. Everything else looks pretty good. Happy with that. Busy, busy flight. <laughs> so, uh, next event, we've got 28 miles to run, so we're expecting to uh, start a descent in the uh, not too distant future. And, uh, Heading radar heading 115. Heading radar heading 115. Oh, that's quite nice. 115 set. That's what we're going to do. Activate Pexis to final. And again, 042 checks. Yeah, We've got 15 miles, I'm going to start bringing the speed back to 20. Alright, right, set checklist. Windshields are off, pressurisation, LFE is green, and landing speeds are all set and checked. Signs are less as required. Next one will be approach checks, which we can do now as we're getting radar vectors. External lights are all set. Passengers, not one. Well, we don't have any on board. Cosfeed is set to off and confirmed. Altimeters 1025 will need to change, so we'll watch out for that and wait until that's required. Next one will be before landing checklist. Two four six, so we'd like to take a descent fairly shortly. But we can't do that because there's traffic coming the opposite direction, a thousand feet below. So we just need to make sure we don't get too high. 
So looking at the other traffic, I'm going to start bringing the speed back to 200 knots because we're going to get a descent very shortly. It's easier to speed up than slow down. Jackson Air zero, zero, Zulu, descend now to altitude 6,000 feet, stand to QNH 1025. So 6,000 feet, stand to 1025, Jackson Air zero, zero, Zulu. 6,000 sets, 1025, set twice. Checks, descending. ED 560, pass the climb flight level 9 and 0. Climb flight level 9 and 0, ED 560, please. Continue descent, altitude 3000 feet. Continue descent, altitude 3000 feet, Saxon, ED 0, ED 0, report your heading and speed now to Stanford Radar 120, level 625. Okay, heading speed Stanford 120, ED 65, good day, ED 0, ED 0, 1, 9, pass the climb flight level 9 and 0. Stanford Radar, good afternoon, Saxon, ED 0, ED 0, descending 3000 feet, radar heading 115, speed 200 knots. Jackson Air zero, 00 Zulu with a straight call sign at uh, 20 from touchdown, you're on base, leg like, check, you're on H1025. Call copy, 1025, Saxon Air zero, zero, Zulu. So the call sign about this, the, uh, the owner of the aircraft likes this call sign. Cool thing is when we go to America, they keep on seeing Saxon Air 007. Bit of James Bond action there. So 7.5 miles to run, I want to start getting speed back to about 180, slight accelerated descent, I'll just use a bit of speed brake, it's a bit slippy today. Jackson Air 00 Zulu, descending now to altitude 3000 feet, stand to QNH 1025. Speed brake closed. A bit annoying in this aircraft, it's either an open or closed switch, you don't uh, choose how much you can use. So. Uh, visual the airport on the left hand side. Jackson Air 00 Zulu, set altitude 2000 feet, range 1 to 3 miles. Set altitude 2000 feet, Jackson Air 00 Zulu. Uh, 2000 feet set, that should put us below the glide. Just a tiny wiggle of the speed brake, just to keep the speed coming back. I'll bring back to 170 so we can start to use the flaps. Saxon Air 0-0-0-0, set up heading 0-8-5, you are cleared to be ILS 0-4. Left heading 0-8-5, cleared ILS, runway 0-4, Saxon Air 0-0-0-0. 0-5, set, approach, lock, GS, speed looks good, below the glide. Saxon Air 0-0-0-0, descending now to altitude 3000 feet, stand to QNH 1025. Saxon Air 0-0-0-0, descending now to altitude 3000 feet, stand to QNH 1025. That's 1,000 to go. Still on the glide, expecting a rate of descent roughly around 850 feet a minute. Action air 0, 0, 0, speed 165 knots or below until 40 MA. Uh, 165 or below confirmed, Action air 0, 0, 0, 0. That's it. Action air 0, 0, 0, 0. Alright, 165 or below. Actually, so sort it of helps us out a little bit to get stable. Localizer coming in. Heading synced. Line rate by Papa, stand set, fly heading 270 degrees, it will be over the top, down with left and zero four. Speed checks, flat one. Seven point five established. Zero zero zero, contact stand set, tower one two three, decimal eight zero five, call sign, I think you're fine. One two three eight zero five, call sign only, good day, Saxon Air, zero zero. Eight, 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 uh, six mile, glass slopes coming in. Six point six, expecting to uh, thousand five hundred, which we just below the glide. So we've got the runway inspection. Going to, going to start bringing the speed back early. All right, glass slope green. Gear down. Speed checks. Flap two. Three thousand seven missed approach. So it's going to be a rapid exit to the right and a long taxi round. So 
million nodes out of bound taxiways which are unserviceable on the left side. Range 1, continue on the restrictors, inbound traffic at four and a half miles, front of AK, November or Victor. Continue on restricted, uh, copy the inbound traffic at four miles, and we'll vacate Victor, Range 1. Nine, four miles, bring the speed back to the approach, speed checks, full flap, landing checklist. Well done, we'll come off the autopilot, landing gears down with three goons confirmed, flaps travelling to full, we'll just hold it there. Full scene and airspeed coming back to BRF. Next checks after landing. So just looking ahead of the runway, planning on where we're going to vacate. So it's going to be one of the rapids to the right at the far end. Alright, all pilot off. Autopilot. Mass landing disagree, we'll disregard. It's very sensitive. Okay, KE then hold in Victor 3, back to 1. Bearing to 1, Roger Break, Saxon 00, zero Zulu, surface wind, 0, 05, 0 degrees, 1, 2 knots, runway 0, 4, clear to land. Clear to land 0, 4, Saxon as this is it. Okay, clear to land we have. 500. Checks, stable. 400. Speaking back to uh, the... 300. Uh, 200. Minimums. Minimums. Continue. We have landing aircraft uh, line up on the way 0 4 uh, behind runner 1. 100. And I think contact London, Romanite, Desperate 825, bye bye. Romanite, 825, Ryanair. 55. And down, on the brakes. Ground sport is green. And it's again for the high speed exit. Do you want to take the 3 and 2 runway 0 4? It'll be a short time only. So you can hear a few faults and a few failures there, so unfortunately we've got a small electrical gremlin with this aircraft. Which one is going in for maintenance? Alright, uh, speed check's good for the rapid exit. I think lights off, straight lights come off. Alright, uh, so we'll be around to uh, probably hotel. Hotel, hold November 3. Hot Hotel, hold the bumper free, Saxon Air Zulu. Range 1, Beckett. So that'll be the next big ride. Landing time, time, 2, 3. Uh, vacating. Perhaps come zero. There you go, super short flight that, 19 minutes. Alright, after landing, checklist. So, flaps up, lights are set to the ground, and chance not there, that's required. Next ones will be shutting down. Taxi November 3. Uh, speed's good, right, sir. I'll just cut the corner a little bit. Yeah, holding on stop bars. Taxi Nets is easy, leave the number 3. Okay. Right, that probably means that we're going to be held here. The 684 Alpha Romeo, surface wind 030 degrees 10 knots, runway 04, clear for takeoff. Yeah, we'll take one, zero, four, one, one, one. Yeah, that's it, we'll take one, we'll take one, we'll take one. Alright, good to see you, he's rolling, safe taxis on. Be a taxi, cross the runway, fix the goal, then to uh, in flight. Zero, 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 November 3, cross runway 04. November 3, cross 04, second, zero, zero, zero. Okay, strobes on. Have a quick look on TCAS. Nothing on final. Nothing seen out the window. Entered runway 04, 22. Taxi to hold at Golf 3. 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 Ta
No, I'll be further down on the left. Clear on the right. See what the work's going on. So first holding points, Golf 4, next is Golf 3, you can see Golf 4. Cross the top bar at Golf 3 and taxi hangar 1. Cross the top bar at Golf 3 and taxi hangar 1, taxi Okay, so she said cross the stop bar, so that probably means that that's stuck on, so I'm happy to continue from there. No aircraft on the left or right, so in fact. Hangar 1 to the uh, furthest hangar in flight. Uh, so just bring the ground speed back for the turn. There we go, 10 knots. Turn on the open on the way in. Uh, I can see a marsh there. So I might have a blind spot, so I might just need to take a guess at what he's up to at some point. World West Turning Circle. And straight. Well clear to that uh, global. Right, there you go. So full got a dabbing the brakes. Carbon brakes are hideously warm. Straight. I'm just going to keep it turning a little bit. I'm going to take the turn there. Nice and well clear that behind. That's it, uh, hello, Tanix, 89 Tango, oh, Lima, breaks off. Lima 3 ready. Hi right, guys, hope you enjoyed that one. I'll knock the cameras off and uh, I'll speak to you next time. Cheers.